Hello, hello, and welcome back to the channel, everyone. My name is Nos, and I hope you're having a wonderful day. Today, we're taking a look at Oblivion Override. It's an early access game that the dev was super nice to send a key to me, and I'm super late on making a video for it. It's a very cool action platformer roguelike Metroidvania, a bit like Dead Cells, and I've been, uh, I've been having a lot of uh, fun with it. This is a game by Humble Mill. And uh, without further ado, uh, let's get into it. So this is kind of a first look video, but I've, I'm kind of lying to you because I've played this for a little while. Um, I've, did, I've, I've completed a few runs. Well, not completed because I'm very bad at the video game. You're going to see that today. Like, um, I have a lot of skills that are not real. So uh, yeah, let's start the game. And then I'm going to show you a little bit of stuff that you can do. Uh, every time you respawn, you have a random weapon with you. There are, there are like 25 weapons total in the game. You start with like 4 or something like that, and there's 21 you can unlock. Uh, but yeah, we're going to be working on that today. Let's go. So we're going to complete a, a run, and then I'm, I'm going to show you a little bit of like all the unlocks and meta progression you can do. Hopefully the game is not too loud or not too quiet. We'll, ha we'll have to figure this out in post. So here we go, this is the first area. There was a, uh, a a patch recently that changes the starting area, I believe, to be longer, which is pretty cool. And uh, yeah, just uh, let's just do it. What a great start. I almost got absolutely destroyed by this bomb that I activated because I'm a genius. Uh, I'm going to leave this here, just in case I take a lot of damage. It's going to show up on my map, so I'm going to be able to go and get, and get it back afterwards. Those are battle rooms, obviously. Let's see if I can uh, actually do something and not humiliate myself in the first battle room. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We're, we're doing good. We're doing all right. Let's go. By the way, if, if this is the first time catching me with my new face, yes, I am a VTuber now. Uh, hopefully, that's not a problem for you. But yeah, I've been I've been no face YouTuber for so long now that I kind of felt like having a face on screen. I don't really care about a lot of, uh, of the stuff attached to it. I just wanted a face because I, I felt like it was kind of boring to not have like a presence on screen and I, I refuse to use a webcam. I'm sorry. I do not want to give away my privacy and stuff like that. So we're just going to go with uh, the VTuber, the VTuber route. Hopefully this is going to work out for everybody. Okay, that worked out better than expected. Not gonna lie, the big axe is one of my favorite weapons so far. There's so much fun stuff you can do with it. I'm gonna have- oh, oh my god. Taking a bunch of damage that I don't need to take right now. I'm gonna have to uh, evolve soon. Probably after this room, I'm gonna have like enough mats to be... Uh, to do something worthwhile. Oh yeah, 64, let's go. So this is the uh, roguelike upgrade kind of system now. You gather points every time you finish a room and stuff like that. And then you can spend it here. And um, there's all these icons there like you can see there there's a mine there's this guy dashing and there's this guy like with an aura here those are all paths that you can take and the more you take of the same path the more they will upgrade and give you like special buffs and then it will work like in hades with boons like there's duo boons and stuff like that well there's duo uh, whatever this is as well which is pretty cool i believe we're gonna take the dash charges and those are all kind of bad. I don't understand this one. I'm going to take it, but I don't know what it... I have no clue what it is. 
Oh yeah, that's the uh, the, the O button. I'll show you. Uh, get golden shield. I don't want any of those. Let's just pass for now. We're gonna refresh next time when, when you have more points. I don't want to go there just yet. I want to full clear this floor. Since it's kind of easier. I'm gonna go get my gift because I took damage like an idiot. I was not paying attention. Uh, it's the curse of having to speak while playing the game. I mean, I say that as if I, d I wouldn't take damage even if I wasn't speaking, but you know. It makes it harder a little bit, right? So yeah, this is the first video of a... Uh, okay, this is a, a new direction that I want to take for the channel and streaming. I, I've, I've been streaming on Twitch for a little while, uh, but... I prefer do doing YouTube video. Like, what I like to do is checking out games and sharing what I what, what I think about them with people, making guides sometimes and stuff like that. So this is what we're going to do. From now on, we're going to make uh, videos, mostly. Uh, checking out new indie games that are coming out and are pretty cool to me. And uh, I will just share first impressions with you. And if I, if I like the game, we'll maybe, like, make a series out of it. Uh, maybe even review them if I play them enough and stuff like that. Like we'll, we'll see where we go. I'll still be streaming for the games that I'm playing and reviewing and stuff like that. that, that it's going to be part of like the rotation. Like uh, later today, I'll be uh, streaming Haven Dog, which will be a video in itself afterwards. It's going to be a first impression of like Haven Dog and uh, how it works. This chest didn't like me. I had to pay like 90 bucks to open it, but. Yeah, once I do that, I'll make a video out of it. It's going to be a first impression of Haven Dock. It looks pretty cool. It's a life sim, colony sim at the same time. Uh, but right now we're playing we're playing Oblivion Override, which is uh, my obsession right now. And it's funny because like the dev contacted me like maybe three months ago with a key for this game. And I was kind of too busy at the office and stuff like that to actually give it the time of day. And when whenever I played it to try it, I was not super sold on it, so I decided to just like kind of ignore it because I was like I was sick, I was busy, I was many things at the same time. And uh, yeah, eventually they released a demo for Next Fest, and they contacted me again for an updated demo. I don't know why they did it because like I never followed up on that initial key they gave me, um, but I'm super grateful about that. And then I tried it again recently, and I fell in love with this game. Like I love the the movement system. I love the the, the I, I love everything about it. The bosses are so fun. We're about to see one, by the way. But big fan, big fan. I don't know what they did since the first key they gave me, but it, it amazing job. Congratulations, Dev. You did it. You changed my mind. Like, the first time I played it, I was like, this is kind of a cheap knockoff of Dead Cell or whatever. But now, now, it's way more than that. It's amazing. And it's pretty unknown still. Like, it barely has any reviews on Steam and stuff like that. I just want it to be, uh, I just want it to be seen, man. Okay. Battle room. Oh my god. Let's do it. So many dogs. I got screwed up by the parkour there. My character just kind of like climbed up but without my consent. It was kind of weird. I also keep getting distracted by looking at the uh, recording window for some reason because I'm dumb. Probably. Oh my god, I didn't even check. Oh fuck. Okay, hopefully, hopefully this is not going to be a... Uh, just give me a second. <laughs> hopefully I'm not recording for no reason. <laughs> Uh, that would be awkward, right? Oh my god, okay. Uh, oh my god. I got scared for a second. I didn't verify that I was actually recording in uh, in OBS. Uh-oh. Okay, 
Oh my god. I'm suddenly playing like an absolute buffoon. I might be cutting out some of this uh, excess stuff that is not super interesting. I don't know exactly how I'm gonna take care of these videos because like I don't want them to be exactly like Let's Plays because I feel like Let's Plays are a little boring. Oh my god. But uh... We'll see. Maybe for first impressions I'm not gonna cut as much. Because like, you know, we want to have more of my thoughts and stuff like that, but... We'll see how I end up making these videos happen. I hope you're having a wonderful day, by the way, guys. Beautiful. Oh, is that the shop? What is this? Oh, it's that guy. This guy always offers a healing for 50% or 50 max HP. Always go for 50 max HP, boy. Unless you're like in super trouble, I guess. Hopefully I'm not- my face is not too big on screen and doesn't hide too much. I made myself smaller before I started recording. Hopefully we're fine. Oh, evolution points. Okay, let's go. Uh, dash. No, we're gonna refresh. I don't want any of this. Attack damage. Yeah, we're gonna go with this. I like taking, um, this one. Which I don't remember the name of it. We're gonna get the buff right now. No, not even. It's what's it? What's it's belligerence. Um. Do I want to go the healing? I don't think I want to. I'm gonna refresh again. I guess we're gonna go with HP. There, there you go. Healing and regen is cool. I like it. When you're bad at the video game, it's great to have. There's a shield there. I completely missed. Let's go get it. See, that's a shield. A little battery. Okay. Oh yeah, I don't know if you noticed, but like enemy HP is represented by like fluid inside of them. Like pay attention to the next one. Like they have a blue fluid inside. Oh my god. This controller is wired. Why does it ha act like this? Sometimes this PS4 controller or PS5 controller just doesn't register inputs properly or something. I don't know exactly what's happening. Maybe I'm going insane. Oh my god, I keep missing. I keep missing. Okay, we're good. Get wrecked. Free money? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's that? Enigma chip. It's impossible to determine this ancient chip model. Okay. Current shield plus 100%. Nice. Dash through this. There's nothing of value here. This guy's gonna dash at me? Oh no! Okay. I'm gonna lie, I took some unnecessary damage earlier, but I'm doing pretty good right now, all things considered. I say that and then... Fuck. Why did I sit suspended so long though? I don't get it. I'm sure I missed, like, multiple secret rooms and stuff like that. People are going to be upset at me. That's assuming people actually see this video at some point. But we'll see. Goodbye. 
Yeah, if you throw enemies in these uh, electric spikes, well, no, it's not spikes, but the electric fences, they just explode. I love it. This is the shop. What do you have for me, boy? Chest no longer costs script to open. I think we're going to take that. Thank you, shop man. I appreciate it. Whenever you're close to a shop, you, you hear the um, the shopkeep just humming, which I think is pretty cool. Tells you you're getting close. I think we're done. Yeah, we're done. Let's go beat... The best boss is probably the magician, but I've only fought the magician like once, twice, twice. I won the second time I fought him. I'm very scared of going for him again, especially since I don't have that many upgrades yet. Like, I'm pretty bad on upgrades right now. Let's see. Let's go with this. Got no points. Uh, which... I'm, I think I'm gonna go for Fight Club. I wanna go fight Eric. Eric is a pretty cool dude. He's very shocking. Electric, even. Let's go. Look at him go. Hi, Eric. How you doing? Eric likes to jump across the map and then lunge at you, like do this very long range attack. Long thing, well, long things. All things considered, Eric is a pretty easy boss, to be honest. It can be a little over overwhelming at first, though. The first time I had to fight him, I was a little like. He was scary. Okay, phase two. Oh, fuck. My bad for being absolutely stupid. Ah, I was too slow. And here I thought I was gonna... I was gonna perfect him and stuff like that, but no, I'm too I'm too stressed out by recording, I think. Oh my god. Bro, you can you can just spam it? Wow, okay. That didn't go well. But we did it anyway, we're full HP, who cares? Like, all this damage was on purpose. I did it because I wanted to. You can't even... ...prove otherwise. So let's go to, um, area 2. I think just for the sake of this... ...run... ...going for a decent amount of time, I think... Usually, I always try to go for Grinder, which I'm unable to beat. I'm gonna go for the other boss that I've beaten already, just so we can get as far as possible. Um, this robot at the entrance here, I just don't know what he does. I try to speak to him and he's just like, Yo, boy, show me your, show me your skills or whatever, and I'm like, what the fuck? This area is kind of it's kind of rough still for me. Uh, like I said, I'm not very good at this game yet, but we'll see what happens. Especially if I'm gonna get these guys already. These guys are pretty rough. 
Well, I think part of my problem though is just that I have to go slower. I tried to go too fast in this game right now, and I, I'm like, I'm not, I'm not that guy yet. I need to take my time and play properly, but you know, we all want to play fast and play well and stuff like that, but uh, I'm, I'm not that guy. Damage taken minus three, I'll take it. Okay. These plants will attack you, but you have some delay. It's like spikes, but it's delayed spikes. So it's not as bad. No. Bad little bubble that shoots. I didn't even see you, bro. I'm just so distracted. It's been so long since I spent time recording, uh, like, by myself on a YouTube video or whatever. I used to do that, like, back in 2011. That's a long time ago, right? VTubers were not even invented yet. Oh, no. I think the enemies I hate the most are these little robots, honestly. I did not forget the script, don't worry about it. Oh my god, I fucking hate that. It attacks behind it before slamming down or whatever, like shooting that big ball. And then, uh, it has a lot of range. These guys with the two daggers are my worst nightmares. Uh, not gonna lie. They're very fast and scary, so uh, we're just gonna leave them. Oh shit, they're following me. That was kind of, a. Uh, Aha, uh -huh, funny. But not for me. God damn, okay. We did it. And they dropped HP. That's pretty cool of them. That's very nice. More money. I'll take it. What can we take as far as upgrades go? Throw circles of spikes after killing enemies. I don't know if I want to do that. Crit rate plus 50% for the next attack after using a skill. I don't know if I want to do that either. Uh, Belligerence is about to evolve though, so we're going to do that. Attack has 20% chance to grant a tier of Belligerence. Earn tier... Each tier grants attack damage plus 3% starting up... Stacking up to 20%, 40%, 80% per tier. Okay. So basically it's just a free attack damage per tier. And it caps at 20 at level 1, 40 at level 2, whatever. Oh, I want this. Okay, uh, let's go. Oh, shop. I have money. Beast Heart. Skill damage plus 25% for every elemental effect the enemy isn't. I don't have any, any elemental effects. Uh, what's my weapon right now? It's a Warhammer plus one, attack speed plus 10%. No, plus 10. It's really bad. Oh. Man, I love this weapon a lot, but I like the walk and roll a lot better. And it's a lot stronger right now. It's a plus three. We're taking it. I don't care. This is and this becomes free XP. All right. I like the walk a lot, and I don't know why. Uh, maybe it's because it's it's aha uh -huh, silly funny, but also I don't know. It sets enemies on fire and stuff like that, which is cool. Like this, look. 
That was a lot more damage than expected. Holy shit. It's not usually this strong. Uh, this is a surprise. Okay. Uh, please. Oh my god, fuck you. Unbelievable. I almost jumped into this guy's attack like I'm fucking dumbass. Let's, let's get rid. The only thing I don't like about the walk is the range it has. Like it has very, very limited range. I'm gonna pick that up because it's uh, free. Oh my god. Please chillax, boys. I did not sign up for this. This is going well, question mark. Oh, free weapon XP. I am not using the lollipop, that's not happening. Free XP for the weapon. Secret room, question mark? No? Okay. Yeah, um, going through um, tubes like this is a... Uh, it's pretty, it's pretty fun. But I feel like sometimes the tubes are a little too long. Like, do I need to go for this long? But maybe that's just me being impatient as fuck, to be fair. It, it could be a thing. This guy just really wanted to dodge everything, holy. Okay... Oh, oh, scary. Oh, probably, probably got shot by the, uh, the goddamn bubble. Okay. Wait, was there anything, or... Was that room just a waste of time? Holy... Okay, and all of these... No, they don't all go to the same place. Huh. Is there anything of value here? Doesn't look like it. Nope. It's absolutely worthless. Interesting. Interesting. I wish this bubble would die. I can just throw my walk at him. It's okay. Plant. There's something here. Let's see what it is. I don't know what those are. I keep getting those, but I don't know what they're used for. If recycled and used properly. Is it for the recycle dude? I just unlocked that guy, like, recently. Also, I know there are some hidden rooms or something like that, secret rooms, but I have no clue how to spot them, so I'm sorry. Free shield, I guess. Catch my guy. Goodbye. I feel like I'm playing all right. But now that I've said that, it's probably gonna go to shit. Every time I feel like I'm playing pretty good, 
is when I get hit multiple times in a row and I, there's nothing I can do about it because I'm bad. Okay, there's a shield here. Let's take it. And there's more stuff to the left here. Let's go check what it is. Free teleport. Okay, this is the boss room. So usually, usually what I'm trying to do right now is beat this guy here the, to, uh, in the grinder. Uh, but I'm unable to beat him. Uh, he's just too strong. And um, it's not because I'm bad. It's because he should be nerfed. Mm -hmm. I'm kidding, by the way. I just need to get good. He's so rough, though. Like, he's so cool, though. I adore that boss fight, but it's just so fucking hard. <laughs> uh. Okay. Let's open this. Beautiful. Oh. Let's go this way. I'm gonna full clear the map before we go to boss, by the way. Like, uh... Who do you think I am? This is how I play Dead Cells as well, by the way. I don't know how much people are going to watch this, by the way, but if you want to see a game like Dead Cells, for example, please feel free to comment down below, and I'll be happy to play some Dead Cells for you. There's a shop nearby. Most likely down here. Or not. This guy's not here today. Neom. Okay, so, okay, the shop is up there. That's why I was hearing him. Okay, am I done? No, there's up there. Okay, let's go get it. Let's go get it, boys. Okay, let's go this way. The mu oh, yeah. I didn't mention it yet, but the music. I, I love the music as well. Like, everything in this game is just... Mm, hitting all the right notes for me. Shit. Yo, what up? The kaboom! I keep forgetting the second skill that I have, and it's so good when I actually use it. I'm scared. I need to get rid of this guy. Like, it's enough that I have to deal with these guys being super fast and scary. I don't want to have to, to deal with, like, landmines constantly, okay? It's fine. Hardstone. This is going to boost my max HP every time I take damage until I'm up to, like, 150 tops, I think? Like, uh, if I want to check that out. I do have... This here. Like, 30% chance of max HP plus 5 after being hit triggers up to 15 times. Okay, so it's not it's not exactly what I said, but you get it. Let's go, let's check my evolutions now. I keep forgetting to do it. Damage plus 4% for every 100 script. Uh, I feel like I spend my script too much for this to be worth it. Smashing Fist no longer generates... Penetrates enemies with Super Guard. Huh? I'll take it. So it refreshes. Call SMD something something for help. Let's take it. This is gonna heal me a little bit now when I trigger it. Drop a random energy chest each time you enter a newer area. Okay. Always deal mag damage. Yes, let's take that. And see, this is a is, this is a duo boon. <laughs> I don't know how to call them. I don't remember how they're called. Uh, what is uh, specialties? Question mark. If someone in chat can remind me what they're called. But yeah. Uh, wow, I said chat. I'm so used to streaming. In the comments or whatever, someone's probably gonna like be. Someone's gonna tell me. Of course. 
I thought we were done, but we still have this area here at the bottom. So let's go check it out. Oh, it's just a chest. Entering boss there drops an energy tank. I'll take it. I don't know what that laughing was though. That was kind of a... That was a... Uh, I'm worried. Very scared. But uh, it's boss time. I don't think we're gonna go for grinder. I want to. I want. I want to. Uh, I don't. I don't know what I want actually. We're gonna go for the initial boss. This guy here, Central Tube Station. I don't know what the boss name is. Do they have names? Oh, yeah, I remember that guy. He's actually pretty scary as well. Holy fuck. Okay. Um, hopefully this goes well. <laughs> the, the run could end here either way. Uh, but it's also a pretty cool boss fight. Hi, boy. I'm sorry, what did, what did you say? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Sorry if I don't speak too much, I'm gonna have to focus. He's pretty scary. I've never seen him do that. That is terrifying. Oh no. Oh! I'm panicking. I need to stop. Mm. Shit. Well, well, we did it anyway. We're fine. We're fine. We survived. We're fine. I am a pro- a, a professional. I was sure we were gonna die here. Oh my god. He did a bunch of attack I didn't even know existed. A filthy gold tooth that has chewed through large amounts of iron. Okay. And energy tank. Perfect. We are... Alright. HP is looking good. Surprisingly. This is going a lot better than expected. I, I didn't expect this to go for... We've been recorded for recording for 40 minutes already. Oh, boy. It's fine. Like I said, I don't know how much I'm going to cut or keep of this entire run. I'm, well, I'm probably just going to leave it as is. Maybe cut a little bit of dead air. But that's pretty much it. Oh, hi. Who might you be? First time here? Yeah, whatever. No one's gonna come here twice anyway. Here, have this. Just to be clear, I have no idea what's inside. They request I... They request I deliver. Simple as that. Huh? What's the matter? Those tin can machines? Well, they told me to shut them down. I have no idea, so no use asking me about it. That's it. You can go now. Fashion tape with an unrecognizable code. Easy to tell that it's not the original copy. Okay. Unlocking a bunch of stuff. I have no clue what it is. Oh yeah, that's right. Those are just blades. Amazing. Just uh, free damage like this. This area is kind of scary, not gonna lie. Um, lots of traps. 
like this here. I don't know why this didn't go as planned. Uh, get two free evolution refreshes or damage taken minus three. Let's go with that. Thank you, random little robot. I'm seeing a bunch of stuff I've never seen before, guys. So while this is not completely blind like I say it is in the title, um, I'm still very confused and inexperienced. I don't know what that is. We can break it? Is that what you're telling me, robot? No? Okay. I have a little friend. I don't know how much help he's giving me, to be fair. But I mean, damage is damage, I guess. Sacrifice HP for a chest. Let's uh, go. HP in general is pretty easy to come by as far as I could tell in this game. So I'm not too worried about it. Oh my god. Oh, I can... Sh I can actually kill those. The cyber bunnies looking guy are pretty cool. But also pretty scary. Oh my. Oh, there's HP on the ground. Nice. Okay, that guy's dead. The, the scariest part is, is over. Look at me take damage against the, like, the super basic enemies. Those are just guys with vacuums, dude. Oh, shit. There you go. Easy. Absolutely easy. This is a baby game. I says I'm gonna get my ass kicked very, very soon. <laughs> uh, 25% nanite fa refund for deleted evolution abilities. Ah, uh, I don't want any of this. I could buy one of these just for the weapon evolution to get an extra buff on my weapon. I think I'm going to do that. I'm going to buy this one and then sacrifice it. We get ricochet stuns enemies with burn. Amazing. Do we... Do we... Do we buy that? The bad jacket? Hmm. No, 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 no. We're gonna keep the money just in case we get badly... badly damaged and we need to, uh, heal. It's gonna be our backup plan. Got a plan for when you're bad! Got a plan as well for when you're stupid, like me. Okay, uh... My guy. Unbelievable. That's a battle room, okay. Oh, hi. The floor said hello. Who are you?
Oh. Oh my god! A three hit combo? He is insane! Where am I? Okay, this is not going well. This is not going well. Suddenly, we're getting our ass kicked by these enemies. Satisfying. Oh my god, I thought we were done. We need HP. Oh my god! I don't- I don't know what's happening anymore! <laughs> I'm not ready for this guy, man. And he won't die! <laughs> he has so much HP. Holy moly. Okay, uh, Belligerent's Chance constantly grants you Billig- Yeah, sure. Level 2. Now we're poor. You see, that's why I kept my money, guys. Because, like, right now we're in trouble, because, uh, uh, that, that room was very, very painful. I don't know what that does. Let's go. Vacuum cleaner, please. Oh no. I was not ready for another room. <laughs> Shit. Please be nice to me. This is not nice to me. Oh my god. I completely missed that guy. I'm scared. Like the run could be over. Right here, right now. Please don't be. I want to get- I want to be, I want to die to the boss at least, please. Not like random enemies. That would be a shame. I would be ashamed of myself. I would never speak to anyone ever again. Oh my god. I'm scared. So fucking scared. <laughs> uh. Ah, that's terrifying. Shit. Please. Please drop HP, thank you very much. Okay. Oh. I feel like it might be smart to go back to the shop and buy some HP before we continue. Just saying. Just mentioning it just like that. Um scary. This is my second time making it to this area, so please bear with me uh, as I get used to these enemies. That is scary as well. Okay, I get it, I get it. I would prefer not having to go through this again, though, but uh, I'll do it if I need to. 
Okay, that was a waste of my time. There was nothing of value there. Amazing. Uh, okay, let's go check over there. Okay, we're getting close to the end of a run at this point then. If I'm looking at the runtime, I'm thinking this is usually around when a run ends. One hour. So the final boss probably around the corner. If I had to guess. Open this. Let's see. Another lollipop. This is the second time we get one of those. Yeah. I'm thinking we do not mess around with A full clear of the map. If we find a boss, we go. Like, these enemies are too scary for me. So if we can finish the run and have a chance, we will do it, question mark? Flaw detector. Crit damage plus 20% and crit rate plus 5. When oh, nice. Uh, newbies only. Free first purchase big brother. Okay. Easy. Baby game. What did I say about not full clear? Oh, never mind. We are, uh, we are stupid. Not god gamer. There's nothing here. Get fucked. Oh, hi. Another... Another beat, beat up NOS room. Uh-oh. Can we... Can we survive? We have a lot of HP, but I, I... I... I wish we could keep... A majority of it, you know? Ugh. Stop it with your balls. Th their balls go so fast. What the heck? Wow. Let's look at it in a positive... Positive light, um... Oh my god, shit. Um, we still have more HP than the starting HP when you start the game, so, uh... Let's, let's take that as a plus, okay? I feel like this attack should have invis- like... iframes. Invincibility frames, and also, this guy just- Completely breaks my ability to uh, dash somehow. There's also HP over there. Thank you very much. This the game is way too nice to me. Like I don't deserve this. I've been playing like a fucking idiot. I do not deserve all of this free HP you're giving me. I should be dead right now, game. It's fine. I don't know why I can't break those. I'm pretty sure they can be broken. Like, I can attack them. There's H- there's HP. No, that's money, bro. Okay. Oh, shit. Free money, I guess? Where do we go? There's not many places to go left, right? Okay. Let's go this way. There are a few places I didn't check out, but at this point I'm just looking for the boss. I don't want to overstay my welcome. 
So if I can find the boss room ASAP, I will gladly go. What is this place? This is very scary and spooky. I took damage somehow. They are absolutely insane. What's what's going on? Can't open this. Okay, we don't have the ID. Whatever that means. Can you please dash properly, my guy? Thank you. Oh, hey, boss time. Okay. Uh, we don't have as much HP as I would like to have, but uh, let's try our luck anyway. Oh my god, I'm scared. Let's go. I doubt we can do anything. Like I, I remember having to fight this guy really briefly on my one of my runs, and uh, it just wasn't gonna happen. He just looks like a more buff me. Oh my god, what am I supposed to do, my guy? Oh, I do baby damage as well. No. Wow, okay. Okay, okay. I didn't have a dash. What's happening? Oh. He slashed behind him somehow? A third one! Oh! No, this is over. This is over. I can't do anything. I don't I don't even understand what's happening anymore. I'm so scared. Oh, no, this is over. Hey, it's better than my first attempt. It's better than my first attempt. That's all I'm gonna say. Holy fuck. Okay. This guy just is relentless. He just won't stop. He's constantly attacking. I feel like... The move is probably to go for, like damage reduction for me or something like that for my first few attempts maybe a weapon with a little bit more range would be would be pretty good as well it's good to have a newcomer much more boisterous now but the guy seems to prefer nico maybe okay sure okay so let's go and do some meta progression together so first of all there's nico here she's our engineer she is your place to unlock weapons uh, grass cutter or the spare? I'm gonna go with the grass cutter because it's more expensive, so it's probably better. Wowee. Look at this beautiful weapon. It's very fast. That skill is pretty cool. It's It puts a thing down. I don't know what it does. Okay, so this is where you unlock your weapons. This guy is for recycling. I don't know... I don't understand exactly how it, how it works, honestly. I'm not sure what I threw in there. It's doing something. I guess I have to wait between runs. It does something. This guy also is meta progression. I think he adds stuff that can show up during your runs. Like this, uh, number two, energy research, sister's clinic, number one weapon, sorcerers, place a weapon modification room in factory area. I want this. 
This will let me re-roll my uh, buffs on my weapons. Let's do that. Having a chance for this to, to spawn is, is huge. Okay, and we still have four, so let's do like this one because it's three. At my service, thank you very much. And then the last part of meta progression that I'm aware of, I don't know if there's anything else, whenever this guy lets me move, is over here. If you go here, you can put that hat on or whatever, and then you can unlock stuff in the skill tree. Uh, I'm kind of tempted to put everything in here, but there's also weapon skill cooldown. Yeah, I think I'm going to just buff that as much as I can. And uh, if I have enough point, I'll put the second point here. There you go. So that's the meta progression. You have a skill tree, you have a dude that you pay to add stuff to your runs, and you have an eco that you pay with a different thing uh, to unlock new weapons. And I don't know if you noticed, but I dropped a blueprint when I beat the boss earlier, which is what added this to Nico's inventory. So yeah, this is uh, Oblivion Override, a game by Humble Mill. It is pretty cool. Plays a lot like Dead Cells if it was in the future. There's robots. You look like a zero... A Mega Man Zero knockoff, but it's I am I'm all for it. There's a there's another playable character as well that I did not unlock just yet, and I can't wait to get my hands on him. But uh, hopefully you enjoyed this video game that we looked at together. Um, I believe this is going to be it for me today, and uh, hopefully you have a wonderful rest of your day. And uh, remember to stay beautiful, and I love your face. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.